I will not tolerate slander towards slime form Rimuru ever from anybody, bro. All I've seen is everybody shit talk this man, but you all have been using him wrong. If you're ever going to make a unit showcase, do not, and I mean, do not put units that will obviously outshine him in damage if you want to make him the main damage dealer. People think, yeah, it's impossible to make this man a main damage dealer. I'm here to prove, no the fuck it's not. I'm here to prove that it's you are wrong and you are utilizing slime form Rimuru wrong and I will prove it here. The equipment I have on him is Urza's Armor Eevee, Seki Teko, and Necrocles. Necrocles will give him 20 arts because he's a demon. He got that dog in him. Seki Teko will, able, will be able to increase uh, attack of the whole team. I do believe it's either him or the whole team by 40%. And Urza's Armor EV is mainly here because of the BE output passive that it gives to my boy. Of course, the two crests I have on him is Herculean Strength and Gluttony, which Gluttony, I think, is probably the best one to get from the slime event. Mind you, I'm recording this before the slime event comes back. I'm just doing my boy justice because he's not getting buffs either way. He has a chance to paralyze with his arts, and his true arts basically increases damage to enemy to the enemy by 20% for 15 seconds. And on top of that, I told you he has that dog in him. Why? Because he turns into the motherfucking dog himself, bro. Don't fuck with my boy. But that's besides the point. He has some of the more cooler animations in-game, you know. It's kind of neat. All the slander, all the slander. And my boy deserves none of it. But I will be showing you how this boy gets that shit done. So I'm going to be having him go up against the regular Crest Palace. So let's show him off. Starting now. All right, now that I've calmed down and I ended up clearing all the enemies, we are now going to start battling this spider women. All right, let's just jump right into it. So she needs to put her little barrier up. You know, we're kind of just chilling at the moment and we're going to make sure we pop off their true arch immediately. That way we could just get this little meter down. It's going to take quite a while, but you see that little damage debuff the boy ended up putting. This is good. This is good. Um, I don't think that Fen will be out damaging him. Um, I, I still stand wholeheartedly by that and my boy will make it through to the very end so of course we're gonna have fina with the constant heals here uh this team will run very low on health even though that mako is here even we have the ultra relic empty heart as well but you know that's how it do uh i will i'm not gonna be using my curse for the earlier part with slime room i feel like i could maybe pop the crocolis but eh, it's kind of whatever at the moment of course we're just gonna keep on healing with fina which is like fina <laughs> aristella she has uh, the Fina name in her art, in her art, so I just always get it confused. Anyways, uh, still got to get this little meter down. It's gonna take quite a while, but it's completely okay. I'm telling you, I will prove to God and everybody in the GS community that this man can do damage. At most, he'll probably do like two million damage. He will outclass Fen in damage. I'm telling you, like when it comes to showcases, you really, really have to like you know really show off the unit you're, you're, that you're trying to show off you know what i'm saying that's why it's a showcase you know m build a team around it don't use overpowered units that will obviously out damage him just, the whole point of a showcase just show off the unit and see the damage they can do or their possible potential all right we're coming down to the last little bit of the meter that she has left on that bar right there hopefully we can break this extremely soon uh we do have a true art off right here with aristella hopefully it brings it out quite a bit doesn't look like it though that's unfortunate but fen will probably be able to do it the boy we want him to come up with his true arch just in case that way we can do the damage and it's down now so we're going to start popping off we're going to make sure that we cleanse here which is fine and end up getting this true arch off with mako which is good which is good unfortunately fan does not have a true arch but that's completely fine uh we're just gonna keep popping skills that debuff did show up that's good we're just gonna keep healing just in case she starts doing random damage out of nowhere uh, i don't do this squash palace a whole lot sometimes but you know the the iframes this girl has is quite kind of like very annoying there we go death storm against the boy is getting all his arts fallen light all right so we're gonna have to pop a clip right here to flambardo that's pretty good since those true weapons going great she ends up getting the debuff again we're, we're, we're getting we're getting somewhere 
Everybody's frozen, unfortunately. We're going to have to get out of this lump in a bit. We skipped a large portion because I wasn't saying much at all. But look, we're still doing damage. We're still at the very tippy top. She ended up burning us a little bit. You know, that's fine. But we're cleansing. We're completely fine. We're still going off. We're still alive, which is the main thing. People thought we would die, but no, no, no. Everybody thought we would die. We, we don't die with the boy. The boy is going to live. Of course, we're going to get the Sisanagi off. Make sure that we do enough. We're going to make some heals happen. You know, but we're all good. Uh, is she putting up her shield? No, she's not. Okay. I think she only puts up the shield when she does the... When she has, like, light elemental thing in her hand. When she does... Oh, Lord. She's calling upon the heavens. The heaven and the sky. He's calling upon God. God himself. God himself is trying to stop the boy from stopping this lady. We're good, though. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're completely fine. We're completely popping off. We're completely all okay. all good, bro. Uh, Aristella's popping off with the heels. My man's uh, fan and Mako are keeping my boy alive for the most part with the arch. You know, we're all good. You know, another one here. We're, we're good. We're good. We're chilling. We're big chilling. We're all right so far. We're all right. We're completely okay. We got the debuff down, so she should be able to. Oh my god, she put up the shield. Oh no, she put up the shield and she might call upon the heavens. Hopefully we can uh, paralyze her here. Oh yeah, what a clutch paralyze. Telling you, best unit in the game. Best unit, best paralyzer. Best paralyzer. Use them, use them whenever the, my, the mines come back, I'm telling you. Uh, let's just make sure we end up breaking this down. Okay, okay, we're doing good so far. Um, but we still need to bring this meter all the way down. I know for damn sure y'all didn't want to see me break that thing for as long as I did. I'm in seven minutes in game time. I don't know what I stopped at to, in order to like skip through a lot of this, but I, I'm not letting you guys go through that. All right, so we're down here at the threshold right here. Right here is where it matters. All right, all right. She's calling upon the heavens yet again. We're gonna do it. We're gonna we're gonna break her too. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. This is breaking her right here. The steel thread break. Oh, let's fucking go. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have enough arts, but I do want to get enough damage off so we can kill her. I can I get smell it i can just i can just taste it she's gonna die bro i'm telling you right now uh we're just gonna keep doing heals as much as possible with aristella because you know you never know at the last second this bitch might hoe us and i am not going to risk it one bit bro see look see look okay okay my boy fen is almost dead oh he's gone all right he's gone it, it's up to it's up to my boy now I told y'all he was going to outclass him in damage and unfortunately Fen ended up dying first. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. We're going to do it. We're just going to try to paralyze her as much as we can with these normal arts. Maybe we can get there in the end. Come on. The boy Rimuru can make it. All right. She's about to call upon the heavens, I think. Yes, she is. She is. Oh, my God. All right. Clutch, 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 clutch. Hopefully. <gasps> no shot. Come on. Let's just get as much damage mitigation as possible. Oh, my God. Come on. Come on, come on, Rimuru, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Oh my god, I almost got Seki Teko up. Oh, it's almost, it's almost there. Come on, come on. Yes. No. Oh my god, Mako, please. Avenge him, avenge him. This is it, this is it. He's dead. <gasps> she's dead. Let's go, she's dead, she's dead. No four plus though? Bruh. Bruh. Nah, nah, nah. Y'all yeah, know what we, we're here for. We're here to look for this. We're, we're here to see the damage for the most part. Eight minutes and 13 seconds. Look. That's a world record. Now, let's do the detail. I told y'all. Bro, I told y'all. I told y'all. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. I'm telling y'all. Y'all are not utilizing this man. I proved to God and the entire GS community that he is the best. And here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Fen broke that. That's cool. But my boy did the damage. And I will not stand for the slander. Well, well, well. I told y'all this man was a damage dealer. I told y'all that all you had to do was build a well-centered team around him being the damage dealer and making sure that you equip him with the right stuff in order for him to do damage and he will shine. Like I said, don't put units that will clearly outshine him in damage. If you're going to showcase a unit, do it correctly. And make sure that you're using units that will actually give them the benefit and or will show the potential of how much damage you can do. I did this man justice. The numbers don't lie. It's up on the screen. Three million damage. Three million damage is what he's capable of. And all you have to do is support him really, really well. And you could do it with any unit. But I'm just letting you know. My boy is not trash. And I have proved it. 
once and for all. Thank you for sticking around. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And let me know what you think about my boy and the justice that I did him. I'll catch y'all later. Peace, peace.